Jay done found the leg she chewing on. Morning everybody, Jason, PJ, Hollis Vaughn. Got a little bit of running around here to do, feeding, check a few things, and then I got something in the truck I'm gonna show y'all I'm excited about. All right, y'all, so I did a little looking around. PJ's running around. Got a package in the mail. I've actually had it a couple days. And, uh, or actually, it sent it to the post office for a couple days. I didn't realize I had to go sign for it. But here we are. From Jeff Phillips at... Uh, what do they call it? I mess up every time. Make sure I say this right. Instinctive Addiction Archery. That's where we went on the trip and uh, got that driving award. Look at that right there. I told him just to kind of surprise me with arrows. Got the red and white going on. Hollis Farm. These are gold tips, traditional 500s. I got him to set me up with everything. And uh, got me plenty, plenty of arrows to start with. I even got him to get me some broadheads. Woodsman broadheads, that's a three blade. 150 grain, boy, that looks like a deadly joker right there. We got a lot to learn, but this guy is the one that's gonna help us. Quiver, goes on the limbs. Screw on, I think as they call it. Got strings, everything. This bow's gonna be, I've already shot this bow. He got me a glove. He had a glove up there, shooting glove. We're gonna get all this out in a minute. All right, I gotta put this baby together. This is a takedown version, which he's got it wrapped up. Let me get to all this and I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I finally got her unpackaged. Whew. He had her wrapped up. Wasn't nothing gonna happen, but for those of y'all that don't know, takedown recurve, got your riser here, and then the limbs come off, which is pretty cool for uh, packaging. Or if I want to uh, get heavier limbs, so let's uh, let's put this baby together. All you do is put the limb on there. Allen bolt here. He even sent an Allen wrench. I love these things. I have got to uh, get out. I got to keep shooting this thing because it would. It's awesome to hunt with one of these. I've killed a handful of deer with a uh, traditional stuff. This thing's got ram horn inlays in it. Right there. Right there. And on the shelf right there. I hope it's not too bright in here. This is a cool bow. I hope I'm putting it together right. Usually somebody, when they put the writing on there, it's right there, so. They are calling this one the C2. It's a 58 inch bow, 43 pounds at 28 inches. And my draw is somewhere between 27, 28. So I'm pulling, you know, in that, I'm gonna be at that 42, 43 range. This thing is cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm not gonna get too, too over crazy tightening these. All right, he's in the stringer and all, and it's a little different than what I've used before, so I'm gonna get it strung up and then we'll look at it again. All right, so I got her strung up. Got a red string on here, red and black string. Little red silencers on there. This thing here is pretty cool too. It's an uh, 
an air holder. Let's turn y'all a little bit right there. You can put your air, I ain't even got an air. Oh, we can get one out right here. Put your air on like so, and when you're sitting in the tree stand, I've never used one of them, that's the first time. You put that around your arrow and won't fall off in the wind and stuff. And as soon as you pull back, it falls backwards. That's pretty cool right there. This is a nice dude right here. I got a target over here. I'm fixing to set it up and we're fixing to test drive it a little bit. Just a little bit. I'm liking this, y'all. All right, so here's what I'm gonna shoot with. He had a nice deer skin glove up there that I really liked, and I got him to get me one of these. Won't fool with the tab or nothing like this, so. Let's grab some airs and try this thing out. All right, I think I got y'all set up pretty good. I'm trying to get in here and target's not but about, about 10 yards. Or well, y'all gonna hear if I miss too, because it's nothing but a metal wall behind this little target. Kind of brave, I guess. I did hit under it. That's bad. Come here, PJ. Come here. Come here. Nailed it then. I'm thinking about that metal wall more than I should be. This thing is quiet. Oh my goodness, that was pretty good right there. All right, so I uh, skipped the first one trying not to hit the wall and I got a little better the second one. Here's the third one right in the middle. This thing shoots like a dream. Knocked the tip off that in a little bit, but we'll be all right. Is this thing not pretty? I mean, this thing is neat. Hunting bow. That thing right there is gonna be fun. We just got to practice the bows there. We just got to shoot. All right, y'all, let's get to today's Bible verse. Still on the word darkness. Uh, we're in Ecclesiastes chapter two, verse 13. And I saw that wisdom excels folly as light excels darkness. All right, y'all, I made it back. Not just a super exciting day as far as stuff we did, but I am very excited about the the new 58 inch bow from Instinctive Addiction Archery. Some good guys up there, Jeff Phillips and Ty Son. Awesome, awesome. I just got out to shoot the bow, but anyway, I'm about to call it a day. Appreciate y'all watching. Out of here.